Hey, you guys. Yeah, let me see, okay? Yeah, you can, you, you, you can have it. Look who it is. A bunch of a bunch a bunch of kids. What are you doing in my house? I don't know. How did you get here? I'm ready. We just walked here. Oh my gosh. I just walked here too. I ordered some fries, y'all, okay? Boo boo, they they can only have a few. I don't want them to spoil their dinner. Here, give them a few. Next trick. We are on winter break from homeschooling. We will be on a break for two weeks. Um, and yeah, so the kids have been here all day. Girl, I don't see how y'all do it with multiple kids. When I tell you I am tired, they got me running everywhere. They want me to play with them. They laugh, look, I'm a fun parent. So they laugh at me because I ain't got no filter. I'm a big kid myself. And so they're like, can you come play with us on the trampoline? My big fluffy butt getting on the trampoline, falling, they're laughing. But no, I, I love kids. Kids are, are, are joy, they really are. Um, so, all right girl, I ordered some Raisin Cane. Yeah, like I told y'all, I have no idea how I'm losing weight. I know how because I'm restricting my calories. This is my first, this will be my first meal of the day. I'm down to, I'm not gonna tell y'all my weight, but I'm in the 160s. I need to lose 20 more pounds. Let's just keep it real. Being in the 160s at only five foot four and some change is way too much weight. So I need to lose 20 more pounds um, to be at a healthy BMI. Um, so yeah, that's what we're doing. I finally figured out what I'm making for Christmas dinner. Um, I was gonna do a bunch of different appetizers, but girl, please, I'm gonna be upset eating those raggedy ass appetizers, wanting some dressing, let's just be real. So, um, cooking um, Christmas dinner on Christmas Eve so we can have leftovers, and my husband is off all week. Woo! Child, Lord help me now. My husband's a very quiet man, so I don't mind him being off and stuff. And so, um, and I don't know, y'all, like our this year has definitely brought us together as a married couple since we all went through COVID together, just going through this pandemic. Um, and some things that happened with us, was it last year or the year before? It was actually the year before, two years ago. My husband was very, very sick. Um, and I had to end up really just, just exhausting everything to take care of him because he was not well. Um, and so we have really grown closer. It, it's so funny, like you can either use an experience to complain and mope, and you know, look at it as a negative, or you can use an experience like going through COVID or someone who's ill as a way to grow cr closer and say, hey, we went through this and we made it. And this is why I married you, and, okay? So yeah, it's it's been, it's been difficult, but we've made it and God is good. That is all I have to say, God is definitely good, y'all. So let me get off of it. I need to upload some videos, so content on me onto my camera, onto my laptop, and see what the heck these kids are doing. Y'all, I scared the hell out of them earlier. I could not stop laughing. I scared them babies. Here they come. Hey, y'all. Girl, I can't stand kids. Yeah. <laughs> I know you're thinking, well, damn, did you just say in the clip before? So it's Friday. Let me start off by saying that it's Friday and I'm ready to swing. So yesterday I did a, a bit drinking. It was a very stressful day. So I'm not drinking tonight. I'm not drinking over the weekend. We ain't doing it. I'm, that's a lie. I may have one glass and not even that half a glass with my dinner. Y'all, I typically like to have a glass with my dinner. And it's so funny, my friend and coworker, Christine, she's like, you could just have one glass? Yeah. Um, I'm one of those type of, <laughs> when I drink wine, unless I'm with my husband, there's really no need to be throwing back three or four glasses. But last night, I had three glasses. It was stress. I'm a lightweight. Three glasses is all I can do. Tonight, I probably have half a glass with my dinner. But let me tell you why I hate kids today. So I had asked Miss Lori if JB could come over. 
anyway yeah I didn't want him hearing what I said so anyway when I picked them up I could tell you you know you could tell when something's wrong with your child so when I picked them up Miss Lori was like I was out there questioning them, them because it was two other kids her granddaughter and the other little sociopath across the street we seriously do nickname him the little sociopath because Pat because this child is a habitual liar he's been this way since he was like five and typically <laughs> This is bad, but he was a little bully at school. And so, <clears throat> JB has grown up with this child. And I don't mean any disrespect, y'all. I, I do apologize. I shouldn't call someone else's child that. But the child is problematic. And so, because of that, when he would go over there, Miss Lori would be like, so-and-so is coming over. Are you okay? I'm like, yeah, it's okay. Well, today, when I picked up my baby, Miss Lori was questioning them. She's like, I was outside questioning them because... They said, they said that JB just tore up a toy and that he's not in trouble, but I wanted to know why he did it. And I'm looking at it and I said, mm, JB is not a toy. He said he got angry. Okay, but JB, you don't tear up someone else's child, but toy. But my thing is that JB doesn't tear up something like that because just to be mean because he's afraid of Miss Lori a little bit. So he ain't going to do that because he knows he's going to get in trouble. So long story short, he was upset. They have been teasing him. So it took me a while to get it out of him. But y'all, then he started crying. I felt bad. Miss Lori felt really bad. She laid in, to, in those kids, mostly when we left. Um, she told the razor, me. The razor was... The and, razor good and I could balance on it. Oh, it was good and you could balance. But they were making fun of my babies, um, calling him chubby. And, and one of them can't talk because her butt is bigger than JB. I mean, all the kids have gained weight. Um, but it's okay. He was crying, Miss Lori. They felt bad. They gave him a scooter. <laughs> they felt, but I get it that this is the age, but... Oh, it's okay, baby. You're joking. You're perfect, okay? Okay, sweetheart? You're perfect just the way you are, okay? Now, we got to do something about that hair. Boy, you need to start you know, doing comebacks. You know, when someone say you fat, you say your mama. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's what we were doing. Your mama, your mama look like a, a, a basket of laundry. <laughs> your mama look like a bag of potatoes. Yeah, it just, just, your mama. These kids, I don't know nothing about that. These are suburban kids. Y'all are suburban kids. Someone going to talk about you. Your mama. I do it with you. I say your mama. And it's me. I'm talking about myself. Oh. I put it over there. Child, all this junk mail. I just be thinking about the amount of paper we waste with junk mail. What is this? Your daddy got something from a mirror then. It's probably something about you. What is this stuff? Oh, that's my um, Christmas gift. <laughs> he learned how to do uh, air quotes, y'all. So that's what he's been doing. I tried to tell him how to use it, but this child, air quotes. You so cute. All right, y'all, let me get ready There's to nothing make. nothing in there. Nothing in what, sweetheart? There's nothing in the bag. There's nothing in the bag. Yeah, because I already took it out, baby. Go have a seat. Finish your, um, you don't want it to get soggy and then you get upset. Y'all like, y'all like my new mama uniform? My husband calls, he calls these my maternity clothes. No, playboy, this is this prohibit me from getting into maternity clothes. You know what I mean? So, y'all, tonight I'm going to be having cupcake red velvet blend. Um, I'm going to put this over here. Why is my phone over here? No, this uh, trainer is texting me, or not texting me, but messaging me. Y'all, yeah, with our work phones, I get everything on my work phone. Everything, email. Let me show y'all this cute little um, thing I'm gonna wear for Christmas. It's really a shirt, but because your girl is short, I'm gonna wear it as a dress and pair it with some tights. Isn't this cute? Yeah, I got some black tights I'm going to wear in there with some boots. I'm going to do my hair real pretty, makeup real pretty. Um... 
Hey, you guys, it's really bright. Um, we are on our way to Walmart to pick up a couple of things before Christmas. Okay. Can you give me a game? No, it's just a few more days boy. before Christmas. This boy is being funny, asking for stuff. Are y'all kids doing this, asking for stuff like a few days before Christmas? You don't need me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, 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 ah. JB, what are you going to eat for Christmas? What are you going to eat? Look, look. Cereal? Uh, yeah, kind of. Yeah. No, you need to try to eat some food, y'all. JB is still not eating food, food. Like, <laughs> we've tried. He won't eat. He doesn't eat meat. Like I said, I'm okay with that. Ew, that's disgusting. Why don't You're you? eating flesh. Anyway. Eating dirty flesh. From animals. And that's a baka. A baka. Child, what are you doing, Ted? That's medicine. Mm. Ooh, it, it's a cough drop. Baby, no, 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 no. Stop it, JB. Stop. I told you if you want me to get your phone. Stop. You want me to get the phone so you can look at YouTube? Or what? Da, da. Now they have these, um... Da, 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 da. JB here had got really, really mad at um, a while back, and I just cut it. I'm like, to hell with all this, y'all. And it, 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 it. Good morning, good morning, good morning, you guys. Now I'm trying to keep it quiet because it's really early in the morning here. Just now, 5 o'clock. Um, it is a couple of days before Christmas. It's like four days before Christmas. And yeah, we are doing well. Look, typically around this time, my anxiety level is a high, just really stressed out. But no, honey, we are taking it one day at a time and I'm, I'm good. So, um, really quiet, not going to want it work at work. But we figure once it gets closer to the holidays, it would get quiet. It was just busy for us last week. But we are steadily busy because we are moving to another system. Yeah, I don't want to hear that. That's boring as hell, girl. So anyway, um, since it was quote unquote kind of slow yesterday, I spent time with my um, with one of well, she's my friend too, with one of my friends, and JP played with her son, JP's good friend. Um, but y'all, I laugh. Um, I've gotten from other people, mostly people who are not from this country. I've often got asked what country I'm from, and I don't know if they don't understand the history of some black people here, or they just assume that I'm from another country, or you know, maybe second, uh, I don't know, second generation. So, this one lady, um, well, first of all, I'm very surprised that she still wants to be my friend because I'm telling y'all, depending, I, let me back up and say this. I could be friends with anybody. I am a very open person. I have friends from all different types of backgrounds, um, uh, religions. Um, I have, I made friends with people who were Muslim, friends with people who were Hindu, friends with people who are one of my good friends is an atheist. I do not care. As long as you respect me, and I respect you, we're cool. So this particular woman is a um, die-hard conservative girl but not in your face but she has made some comments and so the last time I was over to her place she made a comment I'm not going to go into all of it but she made a comment and I snapped when I tell you I snapped she didn't even get a word in and if it would in a very PC way I wasn't loud I'm talking to her the same time I'm talking to you right now but she didn't get a word and I thought that was it but <laughs> They're Eastern European. They're Romanian, so they can they can go hard too. So I have a feeling that when I was done, they were like, mm, we like her." <laughs> so, so they invited me back over there today to have some desserts and stuff. Um, but yeah, but they didn't bring up uh, Trump and uh, anything else again. You best believe that. So 
Yeah, y'all, it's Christmas um, week, and so today I am going to be setting my hair in twists. Like, I'm getting real cute, real um, festive sexy. <laughs> FS, I'm gonna be festive sexy on Christmas Eve. We're doing our Christmas on Christmas Eve, and I'm making Miss Lori and them a huge pot of chicken tortilla soup today, honey. Her husband has me asking me, first of all, I make them something at least every week, but this chicken tortilla soup I just don't mess with because it's it's a bit tedious the way I make it because I make it with the whole chicken. Yeah, we do it from the bone. But I'm going to make it for them today, and I'm making a huge pot of it. Y'all, my battery is blinking, so this is going to cut off. So doing that today, I have a meeting, and we are chilling, not doing much of anything else. Um, my, I'm, Me doing my hair and everything is leading up to my husband's gift. Y'all, I told y'all, my husband's gift is me. I'm the best damn gift in the world. <laughs> I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to show y'all um, the little thing I bought. Can y'all see this? Look at that girl. I pushed all 160 something pounds into this. Yeah, so that's what we're gonna be wearing one of these. <laughs> you gonna get your camera? Oh yeah. I know my card's full. You could just record like that. Yeah, we could do this. Okay. Alex, are you gonna watch? Go ahead, sweetheart. Alright, so first thing I'm gonna open is Tell something was wrong with it weeks ago. Why didn't why didn't I know? Why didn't I know? I, why didn't I know? I I I couldn't find why didn't I know? Why? What is that? I, I should have known it. What was, is that? It 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 was a record. Go to go show daddy what it is. Go show daddy. I got Michael Jackson record. gonna be a shirt a is it a shirt? shirt what does it say what does it say it says key uh-huh <laughs> keeping it keeping it old school yeah <laughs> so cool because that's what you do right mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> I, I'm like, I'm going to keep it in. <laughs> oh, oh, Lord, you know what that is? It's the fire from set. Oh, my God. Woo, I like this. You like that one? Yeah, I knew it was going to be Yeah. Like, you know, I love the babies and a bunch of 
Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna get to the big guy. The yeah. big guy. So, save this one for daddy so you can see what you're opening. Come on. Alright, I got the big one. Okay. Daddy, look. Just look. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, let's see. Alright. Alright. Whoa. I'm like, what is this? I need to know. A box. Why it gotta be a box? It's not a box. Hey y'all, Merry Christmas. It is the morning Christmas Eve and I'm getting ready to make my coconut layered cake and I'm gonna show y'all how I make this cake and I always like to use for consistency, I like to use cake mix, but there's certain things you can do to a cake mix to make it, um, pimp it up basically, to make it seem like it's, it's homemade. Oh, look at the baby. You show me your Christmas present. <laughs> a kaleidoscope yeah y'all he has on his Christmas I have on my Christmas <laughs> what's your favorite present so far baby um the uh ride on toy the ride on toy so I'm, I'm not going to show y'all everything but a couple of things I like to do to my cake mixes like I said to, to make it seem a little bit more authentic I like to add vanilla um, I know a, a couple of people are going to be a little surprised by this, but if you bake, not necessarily, buttermilk or sour cream. Y'all, buttermilk and sour cream are fats. Um, buttermilk helps with uh, moisture, makes it moist. Same thing with sour cream, it's a fat, so it helps with moisture. Another thing is cake flour. You don't want to add too much to this because that beats the purpose. It'll dry it out, so yeah. All right, y'all, these are what my cakes looks like. Um over here jb so greedy he already I, gave, I already gave him a little bit of his the cake is kind of falling apart which means that i possibly should have added we needed more hold which is eggs you want a little bit more baby oh my god look at him just a little bit you are so oh my god child and then i made my neighbor some brownies i made um show y'all are turtle brownies y'all look my name my neighbors from paris texas gave jb this phone this is his present <laughs> he knows how to my husband doesn't even know how to use it. i have to show him how to use a rotary phone because he's too old to know how to use it no that's not what it is jb right rotary phones is something that a lot of people don't know how to use actually unless you and it's surprising that I know how to use it. It's something. Wow. Yeah, you're, I am surprised you know how to use it. All right, y'all. This is my Christmas Eve makeup. Let me stop turning around. Let me go over here in the light so y'all can see it. Yes, girl. Let me show y'all what I'm wearing. Um, my neighbor's like, why are you so dressed up? I said, because I am my husband's gift. They started laughing, y'all. Ooh, child. Let me put this like here. This is a this is really a sweater, but Miss Jackson is only five three and some change. So I really wanted to go in like this. I should have probably gotten a medium, and it stops right here. This short, but yeah, girl, look at it. Jingle bell. <laughs> I shouldn't do that, y'all. I don't want to get flagged. So, all right, you guys. I'm going to go pick up my baby. He's playing with the neighbor's granddaughter. I'm going to start eating. My husband's in here on a meeting. I made myself a drink. Y'all, Merry Christmas. Like, I know. Look, baby. I know it's been. Let me pick this camera up. I'm sorry, y'all. I know it's been one of those years. It's been crazy. But, honestly, overall, I'm not going to say this year has been the best year. I ain't going to be like Buzzfeed, Antoinette. But, this Christmas, this holiday has been the best holiday ever we have overcame a lot um i'm praying for abundance and health and um 
uh, knowledge next year and I am I am uh, I have faith that God will see us through amen and I'm excited I know that we will be victorious and I keep saying it but that's what's been been weighing on my heart we will be victorious we will overcome this and again if you are alive <sighs> If you can do that, you are already blessed. You're already halfway there. I know it's a lot. So y'all, let me go get my baby and I'm gonna show y'all what I'm eating because he's back here and it's meeting, but I'm about to eat, okay?